Hi everyone, welcome back to the Indiana Room. We're here to do another feature of the collection. Today we're in the archives, a little different location than we've been the last couple of features. We wanted to show you the photograph collection and different ways that you can access pictures of Plainfield, Guilford Township, and Hendricks County. We have over 13,000 photographs in our collection and about 50% of them have been digitized and are available on our website for you to look at. But we really, really love the physical pictures which are housed in these filing cabinets. They look a little plain, but when we open them up, you'll see that we have the pictures in protective sleeves as well as acid-free folders. This is the portraits drawer. So let's see, we can pull out a picture of, let's see, this is Mrs. Kofine Mills Rushton and her sister. And someone donated this to us, so we're extremely grateful. We have it um, digitized and uploaded on the database, as well as here for you to browse through. So we have just every top you, you can practically think of uh, for Plainfield and Hendricks County. Here's information on the schools. We have pictures from the fire department, from the organization Junior Miss, from the Keeley Institute. We have family group photographs. We have photographs of businesses from Plainfield and Hendricks County, just, just a really robust collection. So we invite you to either come in when you're able to, um, see the physical collection, look at all the pictures you want to, or if you would like to look online, we have another option that you can do from our website. So we're gonna send it out to Sarah, who's in the reading room, and she will show you how you can access the pictures online. So Sarah. Hi everyone. We're going to show you here how to get to this collection from our website. So the way to do that is to go on our webpage to services and collections. And this time you can go under oops, genealogy and local history. And you can go right to the part that says Plainfield, Indiana photograph collection database and click on that. And you might want to skim through some of this because this is going to tell you a little bit about how we've, um, how we've indexed it. Um, but I'm going to give you a few clues shortcut here. So you're going to click on, click here for the photograph collection database. And then you're going to say search. Oops, and you can see we've already done a search today for something. So we're going to clear that. Um, and you heard some of the things Rianne mentioned. You can search for those um, under subject. Um, I'm just going to type in Arial um, and do find. And what you'll see is we have a bunch of aerial photos for Plainfield from many different years. Uh, some of them will say we don't know the exact year. Some of them will give the exact year. And you can click on view and see them. I'm going to click on this one. And what you will see is the view will come up. And I'm just going to make that a little bit bigger so you can see the whole thing. And that's a really nice one here of downtown Plainfield with the Friends uh, Meeting House here. And you can just kind of see uh, all the way over to White Lick Creek here. I'm going to close that one out and show you a couple other ways to search. Um, by the way, if you like any of these photos, you can download them and print them and use them for yourself. Um, the only thing we ask is that if you use them um, in a publication, you give credit. Like if you use them online, you give credit to the Plainfield Guilford Township Public Library. And that you do not use them uh, to make money for profit. Otherwise, you're welcome to download them and print them. Um, and use them for yourself. Go. So these are just a few hints of some ways you can look things up. Uh, the very nice thing about our database, like I said, is that you can access the images right there from the comfort of your computer screen. Um, there are just a very few that you will not see the view option over here. If you're interested in those photos, you can call or email us at Ask Indiana at plainfieldlibrary.net and we'd be happy to scan them, um, look them up for you and get the information you want. Well, photographs, we have a bunch and we love them. So please look at the database, 
Let us know if there's some pictures we haven't digitized yet that you'd like because we're, we're just working through as we are able. So there's no rhyme or reason. If you want a picture that we haven't done, we're happy to do that for you. We are also really happy to take donations. So if you're done with some photographs of Plainfield or Guilford Township or Hendricks County, and, and maybe you're just done with them, we would love to add them to our collection. Or maybe you would just let us borrow them we can scan them and then give them back to you. We're really interested in pictures of how the community has changed over the years. We have a lot of early pictures, but we're kind of missing the 50s, 60s, 70s, and 80s. So if you have pictures maybe of businesses or where you worked in high school or whatever, we would love to be able to add those to the collection. So come by and see us when you're able. Check out online, plainfieldlibrary.net. Go to the Indiana Room and uh, see what you can find in the picture file. Bye.